Hello, hello, beautiful soul. Welcome to another short episode of Unapologetically Abundant Podcast. It's Friday again, and I want to make this short and sweet to just get you off a beautiful, powerful weekend. Whatever you choose to do, whether you choose to work, travel, enjoy your family, just resting, rejuvenating, that's what I'm planning myself. I want to bring in the beginning of the year and how everyone is setting goals and setting up this numbers and like really putting so much pressure on buying a planners, buying a journals, setting up the new goals. Everybody around us is setting a goal. Like it's like, what is your goal for 2023? And Setting a goals and planning and strategizing, it's beautiful. I'm doing it in my business. I'm doing it for my life. However, sometimes we get so overwhelmed and burned out with just doing, doing, doing that we really forget to connect what matters the most. And what really matters the most is the feeling. Because no matter what you would like to achieve in 2023 or for the rest of your life, you're searching for a feeling because sometimes a woman, they come to me like, Petty, I want to work with you. I want to create 10K months. I really want my freedom. I'm like, it's not about the number. Why do you want the 10K months? The thing is that it's really not about the number and the goal because it's about how you will feel. How will you feel? Will you feel grounded? Will you feel free? Will you feel content? Will you feel safe? Will you feel more generous? Like, What is the feeling that you are looking for? So instead of only, I'm not saying setting goals, it's wrong, but I'm saying instead of only setting a goals, I'm really inviting you to tune in and ask yourself, how do you want to feel throughout 2023? What are the three feelings that you would love to be feeling throughout the year? So you can tap into that feeling because when you can tap into that feeling, call it in and be really intentional about it, you're fueling all your dreams and goals so much stronger versus just like, okay, I want to get 10K months. Great. With a good strategy or good coach, you can get there. You have 10K months and then you're like, well, this is it. I felt, I thought I will feel different. Well, it's because you were not focused on the feelings. So this year, I invite you to be really focused even more on the feeling. How do you want to feel? And then let those feelings fuel intentionally your goals and achievements. So let me know how are you desiring to feel in 2023? What are the top three feelings that you're creating and you would love to feel throughout the year and in the end of the year? And remember, when you pass for a moment after listening this and leave a review, it's like a beautiful virtual hacks for me, which I love hacks. Anyone who knows me knows I am an amazing hacker. And these are virtual hacks, not only that fill out my heart and soul, but also help other women to find this inspiration, hope, and motivation to create generational healing and world-changing abundance. So thank you for investing your time in sharing your honest review on iTunes. And also remember, I love you, I see you, and I receive you.